So electrochemistry question three. The classified uh, paper six. A student investigate the gas formed during the electrolysis of a dilute sulfuric acid using the apparatus. Hydrogen and oxygen are produced. Uh, we have to complete the label. So what, what is this? This is a carbon electrode. Give on the diagram, sketch how a sample of one of the gas could be collected. How we can collect the gas? Normally what we do, we fill the test tube with a electrolyte. Like here is a test tube and this test tube is completely filled with the electrolyte. Like if electrolyte is dilute sulfuric acid, we filled the whole test tube with dilute sulfuric acid. And what we do, we invert on the electrode. We just like a, a test tube completely filled with dilute sulfuric acid because electrolyte is a dilute sulfuric acid and we invert on the so we just have to draw inverted test tube here. When we invert the liquid, the electrolyte will move out and the gas will occupy the space. No, usually, yeah, but plenty, because what happens when the gas is given off, so the, it will push the liquid out. So you will have gas present here. And then you just simply invert the test tube and put a thumb on the top of a test tube so the gas won't skip. Or you can put a stopper. Like we remove and then put a stopper on the top. That's it. So you have to draw inverted test tube on any one of the electrodes. Give a test for oxygen, how we can test the oxygen gas. So oxygen, it is a glowing splint. And what is the result? It will relight. The gas collected at the positive electrode, the gas collected at the positive electrode turned lime water milky. Based on this observation, what, ga what gas was present? So which gas was present, which turned a lime water milky? So that is carbon dioxide. Carbon dioxide turned the lime water milky. Suggest so how this gas was formed. So what actually happened, as you can see, as you can see here, we have like when we invert this test tube, this is made up of carbon. And this one is a positive electrode that anode is there. And this is a negative electrode cathode. Hi this is an electrolyte, so hydrogen will move. So we'll get a hydrogen gas here. But here, when hydroxide ions will move there, we'll get oxygen gas. Yes. But what happened, this oxygen gas which was produced here may react with a carbon electrode. So if oxygen gas which was produced here if it reacted with a carbon electrode, what will happen? It will turn into carbon dioxide. So carbon dioxide is not originally produced. It is formed because first oxygen is formed and electrode is made up of carbon which react with oxygen to form carbon dioxide. So how you'll write the answer for this one? How this gas was formed? So what actually happened? The carbon electrode react with oxygen to form carbon dioxide. This is what happened. A solution of a dilute sulfuric acid was electrolyzed for one hour. Suggests why the pH of a solution decreased. Look, when we are doing electrolysis of a sulfuric acid, it has hydrogen ion, it has sulfate ion, it has hydrogen ion, and it has hydroxide ion. So when we do electrolysis, the hydrogen ions are removed and hydroxide ions are removed. So as a result, what will happen? The amount of or the water is removed from the solution. If our water is removed from the solution, what it will turn? It will turn into a concentrated. So when it turned into a concentrated sulfuric acid, the pH of a concentrated acid is much lower than pH of the dilute acids. So 
for acid, what will happen when a acid is concentrated, it has a much lower pH or it is more corrosive or more reactive as compared to a dilute acid. In the lab for the safety, we use a dilute acid. So what should be the answer here? When we are electro when we electrolyze for one hour, so what will happen? That the water is removed. Or amount of a water decrease in the electrolyte. So the amount of a water decrease in the electrolyte as the amount of water decrease in the electrolyte, it will turn into concentrated sulfuric acid which lower the pH. So when the solution is a concentrated acid, it is much So when the solution is concentrated, the acid is more concentrated, it has a much lower pH. So H and OH both are removed from the mixture. So send the picture of this question and the previous one, question two, which we solved. 